What's good, YouTube? Let's get this money. You already know we getting money. We eating honey. Y'all see the title of the video. We talking about Amazon stock, ticker symbol AMZN. And the market's still open. The market is, time is it, 310. So the market's still open for about 50 more minutes. But right now, Amazon up 3.65%. Let's look at the NASDAQ up 0.98%, almost up a whole percent. And NASDAQ been climbing today. Got something to do with Amazon. The S&P 500 up 0.34%. So that's good, man. The market positive today. Let's go back to Amazon. Look at the chart. And right now, y'all see we sitting at $3,681, man. Getting right back closer to that resistance that we trying to get to. Trying to, trying to break this resistance at $3,770. We getting real close to that. We got denied a couple times earlier in July. Now we making that climb again, man. First, let me show y'all something. Let's look at this chart right here. This the industries. This I look at this website to see the leaders in the industries. And y'all see Amazon 43% when it comes to the re retail sector. And y'all see the second place holder is Alibaba. Hey, Amazon four times as big as Alibaba when it comes to to this patch chart right here so that should just show y'all some show y'all how dominant amazon is you got home depot and lowe's all right but yeah let's just look look at the sector overview this is whole sector overview retail cyclical more than 50 percent of this whole sector got vehicles and parts it's probably when it you know when you want to look at the vehicles and parts you go find tesla probably number one running that but that just show y'all how big Amazon is, man. Just to show y'all a visual, show y'all how dominant Amazon is and why this is a good company to invest into for the long term. I'm investing in this company for the long term. I got in around $3,000 and I've been holding every since. And on the year, Amazon only up like 17%. So it really been moving sideways this whole year. To give us some time to add to our position we had multiple times to get in at these low prices around this support at three thousand dollars we had multiple times throughout the year to get in even in march 2021 you could have got in at 2900 so i would say i wouldn't buy this stock right now it's not in a bad zone in my opinion you could do what you want to but i'm not buying amazon right now because i bought plenty shares when i when i know shares i ain't I don't got no shares, but I got partial shares. But I, I bought plenty of Amazon when it was down here around three thousand dollars, and my portfolio is thanking me for that. But I'm gonna do a prediction on what I think this stock go do. But they've been talking about they got a valuation. It's analysts that got valuations and expectations for this stock. They got price targets at forty one hundred in 2022. So that's a good sign right there. But I'm not going to make this video long. I'm going to just get right into the prediction of what I think going to happen. Man, we, we still low on the RSI. And the way it's looking in the market, it's not that much fear about inflation. And people is putting their money in cryptocurrency. And I suggest y'all look into cryptocurrency right now because it's, it's low right now. It's, it's down. It's not about crypto right now. Let me know if y'all want crypto videos. I got y'all on that. I just put some money in Bitcoin and Ethereum earlier today. And I've been looking at it. I've been looking at it close, cause it's in a nice buy zone right now. But with the positivity in the market, holiday season coming up, everybody buying presents for their kids. A lot of that shopping gonna be done on Amazon. So what I think is gonna happen? I think we finally go get a break through this resistance. I think we go finally get a breakthrough. We go finally break through and get to around 3,800, and then you know, probably have a have a drop slow down and then i think i think by next year early next year we go get to that four thousand dollar mark what we've been waiting for i think we go finally get to that and i think this 3700 go turn into the new support so yeah that's what i that's what i believe is gonna happen um i'm not sure i don't can't predict the market i'm not i don't got the uh i don't got the crystal ball but i do believe if you hold this stock for the long term, you're going to make some money. And $4,000 coming soon. I think we're going to hit $4,000. It's 
If not by the end of this year, we go hit it early next year. That's my prediction. That's what I think about this stock. And like I said, Amazon was only up 17% this year. I've been trading sideways all year. So it's bound to have a breakout year next year. If not next year, the year after that. But y'all know I'm a long-term investor. So I'm looking at what my stocks go do 5, 10 years from now. And Amazon, 5 years from now. If it's not no, if it's not no stock split, I could see Amazon going to 5,000 in 5 years. Even 6,000, man. But, hey, that's all I got for y'all, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all did, y'all ain't like the video yet, do that for me. Subscribe if you ain't subscribed yet. Comment what y'all think about Amazon. Comment what videos y'all want next. I got y'all. I'm gone. One thing they gonna say about me is I get friends. One thing they gonna say about me is I ain't playing. One thing they gonna say about me, I never ran. I don't follow niggas. One thing that for sure, I set the trend. Yeah.